you gonna get a hold hold like uh a man with no job trying to hold on to you so he has some place to stay in the wintertime type of hold Alrighty, so I'm coming to y'all today with a super impromptu video. We went to Sephora today. I just went in to pick up, um, actually get a refill on my regular hair products. And while I was there, well, let's first show you what I went for. Hold on a second. I actually went to refill this. This is the Ottawa um, Curl and Defining Gel, which is usually what I use. And while I was there, two things. They came out with um, a new line of this here stuff, which I have every intention on trying. I just wasn't trying it today because it's a little bit pricey. This normal price is $32, I think, for the hair gel. Don't quote me on it. $32 or $36, something like that. But while I was there... I was talked into getting this. So this is what we're gonna be trying today. This is the, um, what's that lady name again, Papa? Ellis Ross, Tracy, Tracy Ellis Ross line. So it's pattern. So today I got the Stronghold Gel. They said Slick and Snatch. The packaging is really, really cute. So we're gonna be trying the hair gel. And then I also got the, um, no, did I get the hair gel? <gasps> oh my God. The girl gave me two hair gels. So I guess we're just going to be trying the hair gel today. I actually, I thought that she gave me a hair gel and a cream. A lady that works there but I didn't I got just the hair gel so I guess we're just gonna be trying the hair gel today which that's what I actually went to the store to get today anyways which was hair gel along with these two products I'm going to use what I always use oh, under here I am doing a deep condition so I've been I had the conditioner in my hair now for about two hours I ran out ran a couple of errands um so yeah so I got a deep conditioner in um, I'm going to go ahead and rinse this out and then we are going to be styling with this today. I also, as my leave-in conditioner, I just started using the Unjackies Quench Leave-In Conditioner Moisture Intensive um, Leave-In. This is a leave-in conditioner and I've actually been thoroughly enjoying this one. We also have the Unjackies Nourish My Hair Black Seed oil so we are going to be using that and then also what I use pro butter which this you can actually purchase on my uh, I have an Amazon store so I'll put this here in my Amazon store you can actually purchase this on Amazon I want to say I usually pay $17 for this $17 or $20 for that pro butter the Aunt Jackie's intensifying um leave-in conditioner i got this from burlington i think regular price is nine dollars i pay 7.99 for it and the hair oil regular price is six dollars i pay 2.99 for that um and of course as always they give you a couple of samples so i got a sample of the hum hair and nail vitamin I haven't tried that, so I'll try that. And then I got the um, Brazilian Shampoo and Conditioner, which I've heard good things about this also. So we will be trying that today. Well, maybe not today, maybe in another video. I'll do the sample. All right, so that's all we got in our bag today. The hair gel, which I bought two of them and did not know. Okay, so the hair gel uh, is $25. I'm going to say it's $25 for both the hair gel and the cream, which we'll try them both together in a separate video. It's fine because I actually went just for hair gel. Um, it's $25 um, for the hair gel. 
And the cream is also $25 as well, which I'm going to return one of these. So let me put this back over in my bag. And we're gonna take this back to the store. Maybe tomorrow, because I think me and my husband going on a date tomorrow. So we'll run that back tomorrow. And let's just keep our fingers crossed that I don't buy anything else while I'm there. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse out my um, conditioner. And we are going to get to styling. Okay, that's perfect. All right, so here we go. We're gonna go ahead and brush our hair out. Be careful, I'm gonna use a wide tooth. It's a wide tooth comb, and I actually use the uh, Adwa deep conditioner to condition my hair also if you guys were wondering that's what we use to condition all right so I'm gonna get my hair combed all the way out Here's the length of my hair. Alrighty. So we are going to I usually do the um, lock method which is liquid. Liquid is the water oil and then the conditioner and then my styler so we are going to go in with our oil going to put it all over my fingers and put it onto my hair it smells pretty good I always make sure I get around my edges real real good bit more get around the back of my hair I'm gonna go ahead and comb that through. All right. So I have that in. I'm now going to go in with my leave-in conditioner. We are going to put a little bit on our hands and rub that onto our hair. See, that's simple. Set this over here. And then we are going to go in with our roll butter. I'll just take a little bit, again, put it onto my hands. It's nice and soft. Smells really, 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 really good. Like, it smells like fruity pebbles almost. It smells like some type of candy or something. I don't know. But, smells really good. And I'm just going to gently apply that onto my hair. Here's my brush. I'm going to just brush again so that I can get that product completely saturated into my hair and this literally leaves my hair um, moisturized for at least four days four to five days I 
So suggested use, they're saying apply to wet or dry hair and style into a slick look. Pro tip, great for styling between washes. So are we supposed to use this if we're doing like a Can we use this just to get our curls together? Because I don't know, we would have to use this in conjunction to the hair cream. But we're just gonna use this for today and we'll see. So now what I do is, I have my water running. I take hair gel, this is what I usually do. Apply it onto my hands. And it is, it's, a, it's thick, okay. She thick. And then I run my hands under some water with the gel on my hands to soften it up a little bit. And then I just apply it onto my hair. So let's see what happens. So we are going to go into the prep first. So now let's see if this hair is going to make our curls plump and juicy. Let's see. All right, so it looks like we have something going on now. Okay. All right. So let's go into another section. Again, take our hair gel with our hands. All right, so I have as much gel as I'm going to have actually distrib dis distributed I'm sorry into my hair all right so now what I do is I wet my hands again nice and wet and then I go in and I do this it's simple I just so then I get that kind of it helps to curl define my curls a little bit more And I know some people have probably already used this product. Again, I've always been stuck on a lot of products. So then what I do is I just go in and I just do my hands like this here. Can you see how it's activating my curls a little bit more? It gives it the sponge curl effects just without that sponge. I tried using a sponge at one point in time, but it was breaking my hair off really, 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 really bad. So, I'll just go in with my hands. And this is all that I do. All right, so this is what we have so far. Okay. I am going to now go in with my diffuser. This is a, what kind of? I had this for years, so they probably don't even make this no more. It may be a con air. But needless to say, I just got the diffuser from, you, know, you can get it from a local beauty supply and it's just an attachment. So you attach it onto your blow dryer. Right. Attach it onto your blow dryer and... So I know y'all don't want to see me do this. So what I am going to do is speed past this part because who want to sit here and listen to this here?
like who who who, who wants to do that y'all don't want to do that but if you all have made it this far into my video like comment and subscribe for um videos hold on okay i didn't even realize my door was open all this time that's where my light is going right there let's see yeah, that's probably where it was going. Still a little bit crazy looking. But if y'all have made it this far into my video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe um, for videos about hair. I do beauty, uh, makeup, lifestyle. I post a couple of vlogs, travel, fashion. So if you all are looking for videos like that, like, comment, subscribe, and share. Share with friends, whoever you think to probably find any of this information that I post useful. All right, so we're gonna finish this and I'll be back. Alright guys, so, ouch, and blow dry, I burnt my finger, okay, so, oh, here is the look, let me open up this door because I am hot, okay, whew, okay, so, here is my final look, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do my baby hairs, um, because I do do those and I will let you know how I feel about this product um so far it's definitely it's thick okay um the hold is not leaving my hair too too crunchy I would advise to try to saturate your hair as much as possible in water because this product is really really thick it's like real thick um if you try to put your hair into a ponytail, this actually makes a great hair gel to put your hair into a ponytail. It's going to slick it down real, real good, I would think. Um, ideal for slicks. Ideal for a slick look of your choosing and styles that need extra hold. So, they are not lying. Keep your texture juicy and joyful. Um, it's definitely still shiny. My hair is really, really shiny. So I am noticing that. Um, the curls are there. Um, but like I said, I do uh, rub my hands through my hair like this here to really activate those curls. So can I say that I will use this? You know what? In all honesty, it did good when I just brushed um, my hair with a brush. So it may very well do good with a wash and go. I'm not into wash and goes. Well, I'm just not into like brushing it into a washing If I'm if I'm saying it right, like yeah, if I'm saying it right. But if I wanted to do like a twist out or something like this, something like that, that was this, I would definitely use this kind of gel, maybe a mousse. But we gonna we gonna see if it's if it's crunchy. So far, it's not leaving it like crunchy. It is it is soft. I don't want to touch it and manipulate it too much because it's not dry all the way. My hair never dries all the way. Like, I don't know. My hair is really, really thick. So, it just, it never dries 100% with the diffuser. It probably take, maybe, maybe tomorrow, maybe dry 100%. 100% it depends on if I go out or anything like that. So I'm going to go ahead and stop rambling, get into these baby hairs and give you all my, I'm going to do my makeup and everything. And then I'll give you all my final thoughts once it dries a little bit uh, more. But if you have like really, really thick hair like me, I don't know, it's almost making my hair feel I don't want to say that it's making it feel gritty because it's not like it's not leaving it gritty or anything like that but it's that is it's a hair gel let's just say that if you all are looking for a hair hair gel something that's going to set your hair um this is it. um if you are looking for a gel that is going to be 
hold extremely holding like this gel was not playing no games i'm not gonna lie um yeah it was like this stuff holds like if you are looking for something that is going to hold your hair definitely definitely use i suggest this product now if you're looking for a little bit more of a uh, a softer hold then you may want to use the cream the cream did definite definitely provided a softer hold than the um gel but if you are looking for just like it says it says it's going to slick and snatch and it definitely did that um so if i wanted to use this and to make like a ponytail or maybe to do like a braided style more of a protective style i would definitely use this product but um i would definitely use the gel I would definitely but if i'm looking for a softer hold i would probably end up going with the cream or something like that now i am going to get the rest of the products um like i said i don't shampoo my hair often i really don't shampoo my hair but i am going to get the they had a uh light conditioner and then like a heavy conditioner i'm definitely going to try out both of those products um yeah so that's it this is my final results these are my final final results these are my final thoughts and if you are interested in seeing more product reviews i am, I am going to bring a few more of those to my channel as a matter of fact i just ordered the new ottawa um, products and as you all know ottawa is my staple well maybe some of you all know because i have suggested that product um to a lot of my friends and family and they ask me what do i do to achieve my hairstyles and everything like that but um i use i have been using the first collection of the ottawa they did come out with a newer collection and from what i'm understanding is for a more uh process or treated color treated hair and stuff like that however it does have different proteins in there when naturals can use it and, it and it definitely works but um if you all want me to do a product review on the Ottawa or just give you something as far as my regular um hair routine is concerned I'll definitely post that video and I think that's it but this here if you're looking for something that is going to hold your hair look no further because this hair is going to have now one thing let me say this the one thing that i did not like about this product when i woke up the next morning my when i tell you my hair was completely matted i mean like completely matted it felt dirty almost so i wasn't able to keep this in my hair for a extended amount of time only because i just like a softer hold when it comes to my curls but um and the only thing I did really was just um, with my hands with a little bit of oil and water. And I just raked my hands through it and rubbed a little bit. And um, I was able to revive my curls. But this product was definitely, the gel was definitely hard to work with as far as my curls are concerned. Now the cream, that's something totally different. The cream did really good. But just using a gel by itself, thinking that you're going to get like a, a hold or you're gonna get the whole but so um thanks again for watching my video feel free to like comment subscribe yeah and share if you feel like anybody would like to see this video or would learn something from this video share it bye i'm, not bye. I'm, I'm gonna say not bye i'm gonna say see you later because bye is so perfect so see you in my next video